So hey everyone, it's Trevor Turnbull here with Social Connect Blueprints and I'm putting this short video together here uh, to complement the article that you're reading. Um, just summarizing what Reed's talking about and showing you some of the tools that he's referencing within the article. Um, so this article is all about the importance of monitoring your brand online. And if you have a moment as well, go check out another article that I wrote recently, which is titled The Good, The Bad, and Air Canada Breaks Wheelchairs. Because ironically enough, uh, it speaks directly to this topic. Just to give you a little bit of background on the story, um, it's all about Air Canada failing to monitor conversations online. And the result was a rumor that just spread out of control and could have easily been squashed right off the start by simply communicating in a timely manner which of course comes back to the idea of knowing what people are saying about your brand online. So again, the importance of monitoring your brand online. Uh, so when you have a moment, go check out that article. You'll find out everything about the story and what the results were and where Air Canada could have improved on their own uh, online brand monitoring. So the first tool that Reed mentions in the article is social mention. Now with social mention, I'm just going to enter Pancheros as a search term here and you'll see it brings up a number of results and specifically in the middle of the page here I see information from Twitter from Google from Facebook you can see there's a lot of conversation happening about Pancheros online in a number of different social platforms and there's also other information you can pull from social mention like sentiment you can see here that 70 of the comments that were found were positive, 267 were neutral, and 17 were negative. Now if I actually click on negative, I'm actually able to see all of the mentions of Pancheros online that have some type of negative sentiment about them. Now the one thing to note here is that no brand is always going to be talked about uh, in a positive light. There's always going to be somebody that might say something bad about your brand, which is fine. It's just human nature. You know, people uh, have the, the freedom to say whatever they want. And of course, how you react to that is really the way that your brand will be perceived. So you can drill down as deeply as finding all of these negative comments and positive comments and respond appropriately. And of course, with social mention, you can also set this up with your RSS feed or email alerts or actually have it exported to an Excel file. This is just another easy way to be able to collect that information and have it come to you as opposed to you having to go to social mention. Another thing that Reed talked about is Google Alerts. Now if I go ahead and create a Google Alert and I'll just use Pancheros as an example again, I can choose the type. So news, blogs, video discussions, I can choose what type of information I want to pull from. I can choose how often I actually receive that information and how many results I receive as well as how I receive that information to either my email inbox or to my RSS reader. So by simply clicking on create alert, I'm now going to receive all mentions of Pancheros in all those different areas that I specified. So everything including news, blogs, uh, videos, discussions, that type of thing and it's all going to be delivered directly to my email. Now speaking of news, if you go directly to google.com slash news and enter Pancheros, and I'll use a slight variation of the name here with an apostrophe included, I'll see all news articles that are related to Pancheros. So if I click on this first one, the Rapid City Journal, you can see here this was an actual article that was written on Pancheros. Uh, in the Rapid City newspaper, which is a city in Iowa, uh, which is where the headquarters for Pancheros is. Uh, so again, I can see news articles that are talking about my brand. And of course, if I was signed in and had an account with this uh, news website, I could see all of the discussions and comments that were actually being said too. And of course, join that conversation if it was appropriate. Another area you might want to check out is Google Blogs. So again, if we enter Pancheros into our search, it's going to return all the results of blogs that are talking about Pancheros. So you can see here, there's a number of them. The first one being Pancheros official blog, blog uh, bobmyburrito.com slash blog. And I also see fourth in the results, an article that I wrote about Pancheros. This is actually how I met Reed was through an experience 
that I had of going into one of their restaurants and having a conversation with Reed. And if I scroll down a little bit further, you'll see here that here's a link to the webinar that I hosted with Reed, where he talked about his role as a social media manager. So again, Google Blogs is just another great place to be able to find out information about what people are saying about you. And if you scroll down to the bottom of the page here, you can see create an alert for Pancheros, an email alert. Uh, search Google News for Pancheros. So you can see there's a number of different ways to get at all of these different tools that Google supplies to be able to monitor online conversations. Now the last one that Reed reviewed is one called Ice Rocket. Now it does stuff that's very similar to Google, but of course not everybody likes Google and you might want an alternative solution. So if we type in Pancheros and we'll use the apostrophe version here, it will give me all the results of blogs that are mentioning Pancheros. I can also choose to scan the web as a whole. So the, the first one that I see is Pancheros official websites. I see their blog here. I see a number of other websites that I can also review uh, that are mentioning their brand. The Twitter tab is a nice one and it's very similar to the feature you would see within search.twitter.com uh, where you can see all conversations about Pancheros on Twitter. Uh, but again, the nice part about Ice Rocket is that it combines all this stuff into one place. Uh, you can even search conversations that are happening on MySpace. And in this case, nothing comes up for just Pancheros, but let's try Pancheros Mexican Grill. So you can see with that search term, I see a bunch more results that are specifically related to MySpace. I can search news as well, which doesn't actually return any results. And if I click on images, I'll also see any images that have been tagged with the Panchero's name. So that's it. If you have any questions or comments about this article, or perhaps you have ideas on how you monitor your brand online that we haven't reviews, reviewed in this article, we'd love to hear your thoughts. Uh, please leave us your comments in the comment section below. Good luck with everything and stay tuned for part two of this email series.